So this week, uh, my family has been watching, we've been watching a lot of movies at night, and we like to do series, and so we've been doing the Star Wars series since Monday was May 4th, uh, May the 4th be with, be with you, uh, National Star Wars Day. So we've been watching the Star Wars series, and one, one scene that I thought was kind of interesting was in Episode 4, A New Hope, uh, there's a scene where um, Luke Skywalker and Obi-Wan Kenobi and Han Solo and Chewie and, and the droids, they're on the Millennium Falcon, and Obi-Wan is training Luke. And what he has is he has this uh, floating ball, this orb that's that's shooting at him, and Luke has to block it with a lightsaber. And he's struggling a little bit. He, he can't he can't block the laser. He's kind of getting shot, you know, not anything deadly, but just kind of a little painful. He's getting, you know, getting eaten up by this uh, orb. He's getting, getting shot, and then uh, Obi-Wan says, all right, try this. And so he put a, a helmet a fighter helmet on, and he had the blast shield down so that Luke couldn't see. And Luke's like, I can't see anything with this. And Obi-Wan says, your eyes can deceive you, so don't trust them. And I, and then uh, Luke proceeds to use the force, and then he can block all the uh, blast from the uh, orb. And I think there's a parallel here for, for our life as followers of Christ, is that your eyes can deceive you. Don't trust them. So uh, in 2 Corinthians chapter 5, Verse 7, it says this, For we walk by believing, not seeing. We walk by believing, not seeing. And I think it's a short verse, and other translations say we walk by faith, not by sight. And it, uh, it's a short verse, but it's very, very profound if, if we really think about it. Because you can look and you can see what's going on around you. And you can think, oh man, things are terrible, my life is bad, things aren't working. And you can believe what you see, or you can choose to believe what God has promised. You know, it says in Romans 8, 28, that all things work to the good of those who love him and are called according to his purposes for them. So we can walk by seeing and observing and, and seeing what's going on and make our conclusions based on that. Or we can make our conclusions based on God's promises. So maybe things aren't going well for you. Um, but you can either choose to pout and, and, and look at look at what you can see, or you can choose to believe God's promise where he says all things work out to the good. Um, you can, you can um, or another promise where he says that since he's given us his son, won't he graciously give us all things? So we can choose, we have a choice each and every day, is that we can walk by believing or we can walk by seeing. And like Obi-Wan says, <clears throat> he says, your eyes can deceive you. Don't trust them. Instead of looking at what we can observe, what we can see, um, we need to uh, uh, base our life on what God has promised. Your eyes can deceive you, so don't trust them.